In this yoga practice, we are going to become fluid like the ocean. The ocean is capable of immense intensity and destruction, but it is also capable of serenity and peace. You are going to move in and out of very gentle postures, doing exactly what feels good for you. This practice is immensely relaxing and is perfect before sleep. So when you're ready, let's get started. We are going to start today kneeling down to do our seated cat cow. As you breathe in and look up, arch your back up. And as you breathe out, look down and arch your back down. Go as fast or slow as feels good for you in this moment. Next, we are going to do large body rolls. As you breathe in, throw your head gently back and arch your back. And as your body travels back forward, breathe out. With every circle, release the tension from your day. Let's go on to the other side. As you breathe in, Row your head gently back and arch your back. And as you come forward, breathe out. Every circle, release more and more tension. Let's start to make large circles with our arms, one by one, swinging your arms back in beautiful, large circles, breathing in and breathing out and noticing your breath. Let's make our way onto all fours and gently lower down until you reach Upward Facing Dog. Then, gently if it feels comfortable for you today, rock back and forth into Child's Pose and then back into Upward Facing Dog. Continue going back and forth, releasing the tension in your upper body and your hips. Tuck your feet under and lift your hips up into downward facing dog. Walk your feet out, releasing your hamstrings and your calves. When you're ready, start making large waves with your spine, breathing in as your hips come back, breathing out as you come forward being fluid like the water. Hold your plank and then bring your feet in between your hands and gently make your way to your back. Stretch your hands up above your head and then gently bring your upper body to the sky, keeping your hands by your ears in a very small crunch. Release down, and then come back up. This is just to release your upper body a bit. Come down, and then release your hands back down. Bring one knee, and then the other knee, to your chest. If it feels good for you, rock from side to side 
or front to back, depending on how you feel in this moment. Let one leg release down and squeeze the other knee to your chest. Then release that knee and then do the other knee. Squeeze to your chest and then release. Let's place the soles of our feet together. Let your knees drop to the side for my girls and women, gently place your hands on your womb space. Thank Mother Nature for making you exactly who you are. Very gently, Place your feet flat on the ground and gently let your knees fall from side to side. We are now going to wind down this practice. Straighten your legs and relax your legs. Think about bringing your shoulders down or creating space between your ears and shoulders. Now in Shavasana, sink into the mat. Any tension that is left from your day, let it go completely. Breathe in and breathe out, releasing the tension in your body. Take another deep breath in and then breathe out. Take one last deep breath in and then breathe it all out. Let your breathing return to normal. You're welcome to stay in Shavasana as long as you like and even fall asleep in this position. Thank yourself for putting your well-being first tonight. I thank you for joining me on the mat, and I am looking forward to seeing you in the next practice. Until next time.